Strike three, Marley. Based on the best-selling books by John Grogan. Text by Susan Hill. It was spring, and Cassie was going to her first baseball game. Come on, Marley, said Daddy. You can come too. Cassie and Daddy went to the baseball field. They found the place to sit, and then Daddy told Cassie the rules. The pitcher throws the ball, Daddy said. The batter swings the bat. If he misses the ball, it is called a strike. Three strikes means he's out. Daddy looked hard at Marley. Your rules are simple, he told him. Sit, stay. Got it? Rough, Marley barked. Cassie laughed. If Marley miss messes up, we'll call a strike on him. The game began. The pitcher threw the ball. It went way over the batter's head. Marley tugged at his leash. Sit, Marley, said Daddy. That was a wild pitch, said Daddy. The pitcher must be nervous. The next pitch went low. It landed at the batter's feet. Marley jumped up and down. Stay, Marley, Daddy warned. The pitcher threw the ball again. This time the batter hit it way out over the field. They are playing fetch. That's my favorite game. I want to play too, thought Marley. Suddenly, Marley broke free and ran onto the field. Sit, Marley, stay, yelled Daddy. Marley did not. He did not stay. Marley kept his eyes on the ball and ran as fast as he could. Marley knocked over the second baseman, but he didn't stop. The outfielder dove at Marley, but still Marley didn't stop. He didn't stop until he caught that ball. Then Marley began to dig like crazy. The pitcher laughed. Sometimes I want to bury the ball too, he said. Daddy and Cassie chased Marley. Marley ran away from them. Strike one, Marley, Daddy yelled. Marley ran to the batter's box and grabbed the bat in his teeth. Marley tugged. The batter tugged back. Marley tugged harder, and the batter fell down. Strike two, Marley, said Daddy. Then Marley ran to home base and grabbed it in his teeth. He's stealing home, yelled the catcher. The umpire was mad. Uh-oh, said Cassie. Strike three, Marley. You're out of the game, the umpire yelled. Marley dropped the base and stuck out his paw to shake hands with the umpire. Daddy grabbed Marley's leash. By now, everyone was laughing, even the umpire. Sorry, Daddy said to the umpire. I guess Marley's not cut out for the major leagues. Daddy and Cassie sat down again. What did I tell you, Marley, said Daddy. Sit, stay. Is that too much to ask of a dog? Marley didn't sit or stay, said Cassie, but he did fetch and shake hands. Daddy smiled. I guess you're right, he said. He's a pretty good player for a dog. When the game ended, the pitcher gave Cassie the ball. Thanks to your dog, I relaxed and pitched my best game ever, he said. Daddy and Cassie hugged Marley. We're glad you're on our team, Marley, said Cassie. The end.